So what's going on guys, my name is Mr. Dalek JD and today I'm going to be showing you a few easter eggs relating to Origins within the Black Ops 3 Shadows of Evil Zombies map. You may not be aware of some of these and I think these are very very cool. Not too sure how exactly they link in as there is a lot of other things which relate to Mob of the Dead more than anything else in Origins but there are definitely a few things in this map which definitely relate to Origins and give us a lot of hints towards things that could happen either in the future or as happened way into the past which is actually very interesting so let's jump straight into this the first one is actually one of the rift rooms where you actually open the teleporter to go into the rift this one can be found in the uh, location in the waterfront district where if you go through you can see on the table it's actually a map of origins it's the complete standard map where it shows you all the locations of everything in origins and it's a bird's eye view of the map now we're not quite sure why this map is here it's the exact exact same map that you can find in the Origins map, but there is also a map for Mob of the Dead in here as well, and we know why that's in there, because there's a lot of correlations to Mob of the Dead, but there isn't so much with Origins, so it's a little bit confusing on why that's there, but you can find that definitely within the map in this little rift room area here. Now the second easter egg is actually really cool, and you probably wouldn't have noticed this, so it is down in the rift room in the Pack-a-Punch area, and it's actually on the walls that you wall run on. Now, you may have noticed they're not an even wall, there is some like rough bumps around the edges, and there is actually a picture to be seen here if you move out and look at it from a distance. Now before we look into this in detail I want to show you guys an image that you can find in the original Origins map by picking up scraps of paper and putting them together. This picture reveals an image of our four original characters wearing knight armor all wielding elemental staffs and you can see each character's little icon in the corners of the image. You'll notice that the border around this image is very eye-catching and it's a very 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 set pattern and if we look at this wall it has the exact same outside border. Now it looks like the characters in this original image are all holding their elemental staffs almost acting like gods towards the people down below who are preaching for them to help them and it says a Latin word in the bottom middle primis which actually translates to first which means that these were probably the first sets of gods in this particular area wielding these elemental swords and perhaps the first time our characters have made an appearance and is our first group of characters as we know they time travel and there is multiple versions of them now jumping into the image we have here on the wall we can notice some marguas straight away and also it looks like the bugs the parasites that we fight against as well we can notice some zombies underneath these margua heads as well as what looks like some tentacles which could belong to the crazy huge thing that we noticed in the sky but I don't know it looked like it'd be something too huge that it simply wouldn't be able to fit on an image like this and it seems like it's on the ground as if it's fighting alongside with these other creatures. Below the Margo heads we can also notice some zombies and if we look over to the left in the forefront we see a knight wearing some armor wielding a sword and then in the background we can notice our four original characters in their origins knight gear all wielding elemental swords fighting against these monsters. It's quite hard to make out these characters but they are definitely there and they are definitely wielding their origin staff so it's almost like a continuation from that original image and who knows perhaps maybe in the future DLC maps we'll get an image similar to the one on origins but it's actually this one but in a normal drawn out version so we can see it in a lot more detail but I thought this is a really really cool easter egg that Treyarch have put in and I haven't noticed a lot of people finding this out I didn't even notice it for a good week after playing shadows of evil because yeah why would they just have a random wall with like all these random bumps on it but if you look at it from a distance it can actually make a lot of sense and point out a load of little details with the way the storyline is going it seems like the characters can jump between different dimensions in time and space at any point and there's been hundreds of versions of events that have happened including the ones that we know that took place in black ops 1 and black ops 2 but perhaps in the future
future or in the past the characters have actually tried and gone back so far that they were actually knights at one point trying to fight against these monsters and the actual like origins of Shadows of Evil actually goes back hundreds if not thousands of years. Or by the crew going through time and space and altering events so many times that there could have been a point where the actual start of zombies could have started hundreds of thousands of years ago and that was them trying to stop it back then. We know Shadows of Evil takes place in a completely separate dimension to what happens in the normal storyline so things could happen in that dimension which may not have happened in others but it's a very very confusing story arc but a really cool easter egg nonetheless and I hope that down the line Treyarch actually explains some of this stuff and perhaps even give us more really cool easter eggs like this but I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to drop a like rating and subscribe for more videos like this let me know your thoughts on this in the comments section and I'll catch you on another one very very soon.